okay so let's do the brows and like i said i'm gonna go in with almond from morphe this pencil make sure you sip it in case you're wondering earl stevens the sweet red blend okay so let's just see what this talking about it's nothing else to really say this better i don't know so my hairs on my brows are they're black so oh, let's just see how this brown gonna look you know sometimes stuff be looking goofy oh yeah i can barely even see this but i feel like this would be perfect for soft glam because you don't have to so much as darken your brows you can just basically fill them in yeah this is actually not a bad shade it's just light it's lighter than latte latte or like no it's more brown I'm definitely gonna use it though. Yeah, ah, I I like it actually. It's not. It's not. No, this is good. This is not bad. This is actually good. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna do the other brow off cam, and I will be right back. Hmm. Y'all, that YSL Libre, mm, it just smells so good when you let it set into your skin. Like, mm. but yeah, so, okay. I really, really like the concealer. I do. It's just a little too orangey tone for me or peachy. Um, I definitely should have gotten something more closer to my skin tone because as you can see, it's a little bit... I hope the camera's picking this up, but it's warmer than my skin tone. I have like a golden, like under, like undertone. Like I'm a brown skin person, but my undertone is gold. Like it's light. Like as you can see, like it's like a. I, I'm having a hard time like putting it into terms. Like this is more like deep in rosy and my skin tone is more like a golden color underneath or i can even be a, a, a olive like with fenty i go for the olive shades because they always be right they always come out right so yeah so far um this found i mean this concealer is definitely not a matte um concealer because it has not dried down like at first i was like okay you have time to like do whatever you gotta do before it um dries down no it's it's wet like i started this eye then i did this eye and it's wet like it's not moving so yeah you definitely will have to set this i don't feel like this is a matte I'm only saying that because I don't really remember what exactly this was. Was it satin? I don't know. But I like the concealer. It's very good. It's hydrating. That's what it is. It's hydrating. So, yeah. I'm going to blend this out and I will be right back, okay? So, now for the primer, I'm going to use the NYX Plump It Right Back. This is their primer that is infused with electrolytes. If you were tuning into the haul, I explained what electrolytes are. So, um, I think this is interesting because I've never seen a product infused with something like that. Like, I don't know. I don't think any of my products are infused with electrolytes. Like, no. They're like, they be infused with like glycerin, rose, marshmallow, some type of extract. Like, it's never... That's so interesting. I wonder if it makes a difference. So, yeah. So, we're going to go in with it. Let me see what it says. It doesn't have special application um, instructions. So, since I don't want to really get my hands dirty, I want to use a brush. Yeah, I'm going to use this stippling brush from, I mean, e.l.f. It's called Stipple Brush from e.l.f. And I'm just going to, ooh. No, I want to know how it feels. 
it feels like water like it's very thin yeah this is very thin and the bottle kind of oh it has a thing that pushes it back wait yeah when you squeeze it you can feel whatever's in here move up i think that's cool i'm gonna no i'm gonna do two because i'm not gonna i would just literally do too much i don't want to do that <laughs> so okay let me put it on let me tell you how i feel it's cold when you apply it what was that it's cold when you apply it it feels soft it feels like water like literally mm. it has a light smell um it's not it's not really a strong smell it's very light it smells like it just smells like a product it's not a chemically no it might be like slightly just no no it just smells like regular products like have if you have the elf plump primer whatever smell is it's kind of like that it's not it's not bad it's tolerable okay so now we're gonna go into the dose of colors um foundation i chose shade 127 and i pray that this is the right shade but um i'm basically taking the brush and i'm doing like a tapping motion and if you get to this like crease part like of your eye you want to kind of sweep it but for the most part i'm doing tapping motions so yeah i'm taking the meet your hue by dose of colors and i'm going to use my real techniques shade 241 brush and i'm going to blend this in oh i just hope this isn't light like too This definitely not my shade. Dang, that that actually sucks. Yeah. Dang. I even did the what's it called? The um what is it called? The thing that they match you like what is this? This is too light. Mm-mm. So what I'm going to end up doing, I'm going to end up using this as my concealer shade and I'm going to use the concealer shade as my foundation because that's the closest that it can get. And I still want to do a wear, like I want to try the products out of my face and I want y'all to see it. So what I'm using to take the makeup off right now is a makeup remover towel, makeup eraser. It's the original makeup eraser towel. You're supposed to wet this up, but it can also be used dry. But for, for right now, baby, I'm just gonna use it dry. So that was a fail. It's okay. So let me try to put a little bit of primer back on. That actually sucks because I'm gonna have to buy another one, but it's okay. So I'm going to actually just use the concealer as my foundation shade because it's a little bit closer. And then this way I can tell y'all if the concealer can be used in that way. And I'm still going to go in with the same brush. So I'll be right back. Look at my face. Look at my face. No ma'am. So I'm taking 420 from Fenty and I'm basically going to go on top of this. Um. Oh God. I probably cannot save this because that did not do anything. Oh my gosh. No. Absolutely not. I don't want to wipe, wipe the eyebrows off though. Oh my gosh. This is a fail. This is not my shade in the slightest. I'm going to have to get this to my best friend. That might be her shade because no ma'am. Look at my face. Okay, y'all. I'm just going to go wipe it off. 